Sri Narottam Das Thakur is very nicely saying, Nidayer Karuna Hove, Braje Radha Krishna Pave. When one receives the mercy of Balram, Nityananda, one can attain the Lord's feet of Radha and Krishna very easily. Say, Samband Nayar, Brathajanma, Kedata, Vidya Kulehi Kariveta. If one has no connection with Nithai, say Samband Nahiyar, whoever who has no connection with Nityananda, Bratha Janma Gelatar, his life is wasted. Then, even though one is a very learned scholar or Gyani, Vidya Kulehi Karive Tar, even he is very, very great scholar, very great Gyani, or Vidya Kule, or another thing is, he has taken birth in a very respectable family. He may have very big family, rich family, respectable family. These assets, Vidya Kule hi Karibeta, these assets means great knowledge or great birth will not help him. Nothing can help him. What will happen? Vrtha Janma Gelata. His life is gone. Useless, wasted, he wasted his life. Why? Because he has not developed his connection with Nityananda with Parana. This is a problem. <laughs> okay, we must therefore conquer the enemies of Krishna consciousness with the strength received from Balaram. So, in order to conquer the enemies, Kama, Kro, the Log, Mo, Mad, Matsar, these are the enemies of Krishna Bhakti, Krishna consciousness. In order to conquer these enemies, we need a strong squad of knowledge. Who will give that? Krishna. And who will give the power to kill these enemies? Power will come from Balaram. So, that is why Prabhupada is writing here that one cannot attain the goal of life without the mercy of Balaram. Very nicely Prabhupada here said this thing. Okay, that Balram is Nityananda in Kali Yuga. Okay, Brajendra Nandaniyai Sachi Shruta Huila Sai Balram Huila Nitai. Okay, Balram, this in our Hare Krishna Maha Mantra, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. This Ram is Balram. Okay. And that's why we are chanting Krishna and Balram. Prabhupada is saying that in this age of Kaliva, we have to take shelter of Krishna and Balram. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Nityananda Prabhu. So, same Krishna Balram, they have come massively in Kaliva. Why? Especially they have come to deliver the fallen souls of like me. All the wretched soul, rascal people. They to deliver them, Krishna and Balram mercifully came in the form of Chaitanya and Nityananda Gauranga and Nityananda Gaurnitai Papi Tapi Yata Chika Harinam Uddarila. Ah, anybody can come. This is so nice, so merciful. Chaitanya and Nityananda Prabhu is so merciful. Anybody can come. Papi Tapi Yata Chika. Most rest people can come to Gaurang Mahaprabhu. See, that's what the example of Jagai and Madai is there. They will, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Nityananda Prabhu, they will deliver everybody. What is their weapon is? Sankirtana, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Ram. Okay, so Prabhupada is saying that one should accept the sword of knowledge from Krishna and be strong with the mercy of Balaram. And that is why Prabhupada is saying we are worshipping Krishna Balaram in Vrindavan. Very nice this thing. Krishna Balaram ki jaya. 46 is sloka. Nochet Pramattam Asadindriya Vaji Sutta Nikod Patam Vishadasyusu Nikshipanti Te das yava saha suta mamunta mamunte sansar kupu kumrit yu haye chipanti. No che, if we do not follow the instructions of Achyuta, Krishna, and do not take shelter of Balaram, 
Paramattam careless, inattentive, asad, which are always prone to material consciousness. Indriya, the senses, largely acting as the horse, sutta, the chariot driver. Intelligence. Nitva, bringing Utpatham to the roadway of material desire. Vishaya, the sense, object, the shiru. In the hands of the plunderers, Nikshipanti, Thro, Te, Go, Dashyava, Plunderers, Sabe, Best, Come, the Horses, and Cherry Driver. Among all of the Tamat are from their clients, Sar, who take to the wealth of the village. Guru, Great, Mirti, Vahe, Fear of Death, Shipanti, Thro. Translation Otherwise, if one does not take shelter, so we discuss now. If we take shelter of Krishna and Balram, what will happen? Otherwise, if one does not take shelter of Achyuta, Krishna and Baladev, then the senses acting as the horses and the intelligence acting as the driver. We should remember the analogy in the previous sloka it came. Both being prone to material contamination inattentively bring the body okay, which is acting as the chariot to the path of sense gratification okay if we are not taking shelter of krishna and palanam what will happen we discuss now that this body is like chariot okay and horses are like senses and mind is that rain and intelligence is driver so all these things will become materially contaminated and what will happen when the senses are materially contaminated intelligence is materially contaminated they will bring the body towards that means the chariot horses are con- attached uh, attracted by sense gratification and the driver is also allowing what will happen the chariot will go to the hell right it will fall into ditch the same way the body now, because the senses and intelligence is contaminated by material contamination, material contamination, then they will take the body to the path of sense gratification. When one is thus attracted again by the laws of Vishaya, eating, sleeping, and mating, the horses and chariot driver are thrown. Horses and chariot driver are thrown into the blinding dark well of real existence and one is again put into dangerous and extremely fearful situation of repeated birth and death. Okay. So, without the protection of Gaur Nithai, Prabhupada is saying, without the protection of Gaur Nithai, Krishna and Balram, there is no difference. Gauranga is Krishna, Nityananda is Balram, so without the mercy of God, Nithai, Krishna Balram, one cannot get out of the dark well of ignorance in material existence. This is indicated here by the word no chain, which means that one will always remain in the dark well of material existence. The living entity must get strength from Nithai Gaura or Krishna Balram. One must get the mercy, the strength from Balaram and uh, Krishna and Nityananda Gauranga. Why? Because without the mercy of Nithai Gaura, there is no way to come out of this dark well of ignorance. There is no way at all to come out of this material dark well. As stated in Chaitanya Charita Mitra, one day Sri Krishna Chaitanya Nityananda Samodita Gaudo Daye Pushpavanta Chitra Santa Tamonuda. I offer my respectful obeisances unto Sri Krishna Chaitanya and Lord Nityananda. One day, Sri Krishna Chaitanya Nityananda Sahodha. You are like the sun and moon. They have arisen simultaneously on the origin of Gauda to dissipate the darkness. Gauda Daye Pushpavanta. They have arisen in the origin of Gauda to dissipate the darkness. Chitra Shandha Tamanudha. Uh, they have 
arising to dissipate the darkness of ignorance and thus wonderfully bestow the gifts of God. This material world is a dark well of ignorance. The fallen soul in this dark well must take shelter of the lotus of the Lord Thai for Thus, he can easily emerge from material existence. By the mercy of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Nityananda Prabhu, he can easily come out of the material world without their strength. Simply attempt, without approaching Gaur Nithai, simply attempting to get out of the clutches of matter by his creative knowledge will be insufficient. One may think, oh, I will learn everything, all the shlokas, I will buy at this, this, everything I will learn. And I will come out of my existence. No, never, nahi, not. Okay, we need the mercy of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Nityananda Prabhu. Gauranga and Nityananda.